Hi everybody. Uh, YouTuber Scott Philbrook pointed out in the comments on my original binding adjustment video that I didn't include a part on how to properly set the toe cup height uh, at the front of the binding. This is the toe cup area of the binding. Um, the purpose of it obviously is to retain the little lip on the front of your ski boot. Um, the height needs to be set correctly so that your boot can safely pop out of the bindings. Um, if this plastic piece here is really clamped down on the front of your boot, your boot's not going to be able to pop out. And obviously if it's too loose, it's just not going to work. Um, so you have to adjust the height correctly. The correct adjustment is essentially the thickness of the front of your boot, because it obviously has to fit in here, plus an extra half a millimeter. And the extra half millimeter is to ensure that you're not clamped down too tight on the front of the boot and then it can pop out. Um, so the question of course is how do you set that extra half millimeter? I mean it's easy to crank down on the lip of your boot, but how do you set that extra half millimeter? And it actually turns out the answer is pretty straightforward. Um, in my, what you need in engineering would be called a feeler gauge. Um, what you can use in real life if you don't have those at home uh, is a business card. This is an expired RDM member bonus card. Um, you know, you don't want to use a credit card that's going to be too thick, a sheet of paper is going to be too thin, but something in between with a little bit of, you know, thickness to it uh, is what you want to use. Now, in my case, I happen to have digital calipers at home that I use for other projects, and I was able to measure this uh, card, and it is actually 0.35 millimeters thick, so it's a little on the thin side. Um, but I'll show you, you know, how we can address that if you have the ability to measure um, what you're using as your feeler gauge. If you don't have the ability to measure, like I said, pick a business card, pick something with a little bit of thickness to it, um, and just kind of run with that. But otherwise, I'll, I'll sort of explain how to counteract something that's too thin. Um, so how to, how to do this, how to make the adjustment. Um, the adjustment itself, before I get the boot in there, the adjustment itself is very easy. It's, it's done with this screw here, and you turn the screw, and, it, and this plastic piece moves up and down. Um, and that's how you set the height. So that part is very easy, but in terms of getting that extra half millimeter in there, take your feeler gauge, take your business card, whatever, put it on the, uh, the front of the binding, right? It's called the, this is called the anti-friction device, but put it, put it on top of that. Uh, and then take your boot and pop it into the binding. Okay. And that moved a little bit. Um, like that. Okay, so now you can see we've got this business card, we've got this piece inside the binding. And if I try to pull on this right now with both fingers, I mean, I can get it out, but I really kind of have to grip real hard with both of my fingers and pull. Uh, so this is too tight. So what I need to do is loosen this up. So I'm going to just do it, uh, maybe we'll do it just a turn or so there. And the goal here, again, in, in a case where you've got something that's perfect half millimeter thickness, the goal is that you can take your two fingers and pretty easily pull it, you know, out and then push it back in. It shouldn't, if you took the ski and kind of tilted it, it shouldn't fall out. It, you know, it should take a little bit of pulling, um, but not a lot, right? You want it just, just barely holding on to that card. Now, that's if you've got perfect half millimeter thickness. In my case, um, this is 0.35. Like I said, I know that because I measured it. So what I would expect is if this is set properly at half millimeter, this is going to come out pretty easily. It's going to come out with relatively little pulling at all um, because it's thinner than half a millimeter. So what I'm going to do is just keep keep backing this out. I'm going to go another um, go another half turn there. That comes in and out. You can see. I mean, I'm having no problem at all pushing that in and out. Uh, that's pretty easy. Let me go, let's, let's just go a little bit past that just to see. We'll go quarter turn more. And that goes in and out, you know, very easily at this point. We'll go another quarter turn, and that's, that's almost fallen out. So I think that in my case, quarter turn back, right like that, is going to be right where we want that, want that set. So that's how you do it. Um, it's very, very simple. Um, and so you combine this video with my other binding adjustment video, and I think at this point you've kind of got the whole thing covered. So thanks for watching.